So the whole idea of this particular batch of rice is to make a good environment to grow mold. All alcoholic beverages basically have to exchange sugar to the, to the yeast to get uh, alcohol. For us, we have another challenge in that our sugar, the glucose, is bound up in starch. The mold goes onto the rice grain and actually exudes uh, uh, enzymes as it penetrates into the rice, and this actually breaks down the starches into the glucose. You should see a little bit of a powder sugary kind of a look to it, and that is the start of it growing uh, the mold. It's called koji. When you add the koji to the batch, uh, the mold, per se, dies because it can't live in oxygen, but the enzymes of the mold live on. And this comes to a really interesting uh, part of sake, is that uh, the enzymes continue to break down the starch into glucose while it's brewing. The idea is, is that while it's brewing, more sugar is becoming available. Uh, so the, the, it helps uh, define some of the sake characteristics as being a little bit more lighter and delicate and yet still uh, rich and flavorful.